What's going on everybody, I'm Ferret and today we are fighting Lothric and Lorien, the princes. So we'll first start off with the Lothric here, when you get in the door roll away because he usually like, teleports behind you and smacks you. And then basically what we're going to do is we're going to stay close to him and roll through his first two attacks and then hit him once and then roll through his next two attacks. And if he goes far away like he, well he's not going to do it now, but usually when he goes far away he does a special attack which you'll see later and that screws you over so stay away from that because that probably will kill you one shot. So as you see just get close to him, uh, stand around him, I'm getting <laughs> hit quite a bit here. But yeah just roll through his attacks, it's not that bad and then hit him and basically just keep doing that for the whole first half. This boss fight would be super easy with a ranged character because I'm sure you can just cheese him from far away but I'm playing as a melee world here so I'm just going in um, yeah, and then just keep smacking at him like that until you get him and that's the first part done. Um, I, this was only the second time I fought him so I was just seeing what he did. There's that fancy move, don't get hit by that, it will kill you one shot, just wait for it to come in and roll. Um, yeah, so I'm getting hit a lot more because I was still learning the timings and stuff because this boss isn't that bad to beat and if you're having trouble this boss is so easy with phantoms I, I was helping a few people and it's ridiculously easy. Anyway, here we're going into the second half of the fight where the sister comes to join in. So now basically you're going to do the same thing as we're doing, staying close and rolling through his attacks but now aim for his back and don't... Uh, yeah, right at the beginning here yeah, I got hit a whole lot by like everything I was just spamming that Estus, drinking that Sunny D. Um, but yeah, so what you want to do is hit him in the back because that's where the uh, other prince is, Lothric. Um, and that's one you have to kill because if every time you kill Lorien, he just, uh, Lothric just revives and then you start again. Oh, and then basically you have to keep killing him, but you get a lot of free hits in on on Lothric when you kill Lorien. So basically, uh, I didn't know this yet because this is the first time I actually uh, was doing this part of the fight, so I was just hitting him in the front, but what you're going to want to do is always roll behind him and hit him in the back, because um, you'll see now when he dies, because he's about to die, uh, that one heals him. And when they heal him, watch out, you can get a few hits in, but then roll out because she does an AoE, or he, I'm not sure what, what gender is supposed to be. Um, does an AoE attack that gets you, so uh, yeah, you see like that. So you can get a couple hits in, but then roll out, and then now you'll see I just go for the back. So stay close, roll through the attacks, and then hit them in the back every time you can. Uh, one or two, depending on how fast your weapon is, you'll know, um, you'll know how fast your weapon is and how many attacks you can get in. So watch out for yeah that stuff and. Um, if you're a ranged character, that might, the second bit might be harder because you have to hit him in the back. <laughs> but with melee, this but isn't so bad. Um, actually, the whole fight isn't so bad. It's, it's a, a yeah, character. For me, still the hardest boss has been uh, Pontus Sullivan, but I know a lot of people doesn't don't agree with that. Anyway, so yeah, just keep going behind him and smack him in the back every now and again. Usually when he goes away like that, he does a special attack that really gets you, and in the second half, uh, after he does that, she shoots a powerful soul arrow that gets you. Anyway, so now you can get a few hits in, and that's basically that's when I kill them. So, yeah, I'm sure you won't have too much trouble with this, and if you do, just summon a phantom and it's easy cheesy. Alright, so thank you all for watching, and I'll see you for the next boss fight. Bye.